Hello, welcome to my review of Netflix movie Red Notice. Perhaps they should rename it Red Warning. <laughs> that should be a hint what I think of the movie. Um, you know, I like The Rock. I like Gal Gadot. I like Ryan Reynolds. In small doses. You know, I like Ryan Reynolds when he's in more serious role. One of my favorite movies that he did that I think a lot of people did not see. Safe House with Denzel Washington. If you haven't seen it, I believe it is either on Netflix or Hulu or Amazon Prime. I have rewatched it recently. I have all three services in my subscription. So I watch it. My son actually sat down and watched it with me and he liked it. Um, you know, Ryan Reynolds is funny, but I can only take him in small doses. Like even in Deadpool, I liked it, but when it comes down to humor, sometimes it's just too much. And in this movie, literally everything that comes out of his mouth is a funny line. Literally. seem like almost everything that he said is something supposed to be funny or make you laugh. And I think for, for many people, maybe that's what they want. Okay. <laughs> like I said, when it comes down to humor, it's different for many different people. For me, it is a little bit much, but the bigger problem is the silliness of the movie. Okay. It's, it's a fun action comedy. Okay. And sure. It's on Netflix. I didn't have to pay for it, but I'm glad I did not have to pay for it because I would give this movie a five out of 10. It's over the top silly. Okay. It, it's, I like heist movie and I was hoping that um, more to it. The best part of this movie is the heist or getting ready, getting prepared, uh, to break into something that part I enjoy, but or some of the stuff is insane, okay? It's insane silly. This is a non-spoiler review, so I can't say much, but there was a scene where they stumble into like a, a treasure, a cave, and inside the cave are cars that have been in there for 60, 70 years. Yeah, classic cars from World War II that have been there since World War II. And, uh, Without much trouble, they were able to start the car and go on a car chase. Yeah, that that, that scenes, that entire sequence was just so full of nonsense. <laughs> oh, I can't help but cringe and say, is it over yet? The way they ended the movie, I'm sure they might consider a sequel. And um, yeah, like I said, if it works for you, then I, I guess you want to see a sequel. But for me, it is a red warning to see any more from this series. <laughs> Definitely not something I want to watch a second time. Bye-bye.